Reigniting Atlas's legacy of launching humans to space, ULA is using an Atlas V rocket to launch the crew flight test. At the base of the rocket is the Atlas V Common Core Booster, powered by an RD-180 engine. For additional thrust at liftoff, two solid rocket boosters, or SRBs, are attached to the booster. Atop the booster is ULA's ultra-thin stainless steel Centaur upper stage, powered by two RL-10A engines. Next, the aero skirt enhances Atlas's aerodynamic characteristics, stability, and loads. The Starliner spacecraft, which can carry up to five crew members, is attached to the Atlas V rocket with a launch vehicle adapter. Additionally, an emergency detection system provides an extra layer of safety for astronauts. With production complete, the rocket travels from ULA's factory in Alabama to the launch site in Cape Canaveral on ULA's rocket ship. Once in Florida, ULA's launch operations team begins a series of events leading to today's countdown. The process begins by lifting the 107-foot booster onto the mobile launch platform, or MLP. Next, we mate the SRBs. The Centaur upper stage is then transported to the Vertical Integration Facility, or VIF, and lifted into position. Boeing's Starliner spacecraft is lifted and mated to the Atlas V rocket. Once fully assembled, the launch countdown begins with moving the rocket from the VIF to the pad. Riding atop the MLP, the trip is about one-third of a mile and takes approximately 20 minutes. With the Atlas rocket in place, aside the 200-foot-tall crew access tower, the crew access arm swings into place. Next, the rocket is fueled with liquid oxygen, liquid kerosene, and liquid hydrogen. With fueling complete, the blue team comprised of eight specialists from ULA and Boeing, enters the pad to ready the White Room and Starliner spacecraft for astronaut arrival. Approximately three hours before launch, astronauts Barry Butch Wilmore and Sunita Sunny Williams arrive at Space Launch Complex 41, ascend the crew access tower, and make the short walk through the crew access arm to Starliner. Following final preparations and astronaut securing, the blue team departs the pad. As the astronauts continue preparations for liftoff, an elite group of ULA specialists serve as an ascent flight control team dedicated to monitoring the health and performance of the Atlas V rocket during the climb to space. These highly trained engineers provide real-time status of the Atlas V vehicle and assist in making decisions with NASA's flight director at Mission Control in Houston.